one sec. Still got it? Let's see what this thing's made of. Okay, I've overlaid the serum with an old sample of Connor's blood. If you can destroy the atoms blocking the lizard receptors, we can make an antidote, and then we're golden. Like a goose. Like a clever goose. There. Huzzah? Huzzah. Wait, does the structure look unstable to you? Huh. If we could beam a few electrons in there, it'd stabilize it, but it's not like we have a... Particle, particle accelerator? accelerator. <laughs> That'd be like using a shotgun for a haircut. Hell of a haircut. The text said it needs repair, but maybe it's okay. Okay. No black holes, no black holes, no black holes. Huh. <sighs> Pressure change popped an intersection out of alignment. There's no way to fix it without going inside. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? The suit will protect me, right? Peter, I don't know about this. Relax and be a good proton. Huh? Stay positive. Well, what's the inside of a particle accelerator like? Amazing! You gotta crawl in this when you get the suit back. Oh, yeah, it's at the top of my list. What's gonna happen when I realign it anyway? If there aren't any other pressure problems, nothing. You can come right out. I got it. Do not wipe my library cards. Don't touch the beam. Don't touch the beam. Next. You did it, Pete. We're home free. Come on out. What is that? Probably a static discharge. It means the accelerator is working. Clever freaking goose. Here we come. So the suit's got some sensitive ears. Apparently. What happened? More static discharges. The accelerator's still running, though. The serum's okay. Fire. Got it! I can't let that 
fire fast enough. There's got to be something else I can use. That'll work. Good, good. The static discharges must have fried our fire suppression sensors. I'll try to trigger them manually. Is the antidote still getting made? Should be. But if the fires damage the accelerator, we'll lose it. Stop with the spreading already! That fire is too big for webs. Need to improvise. Nice water pressure. Easy. Everything down here is clear. I just need to help out upstairs. Harry won't be able to put out the rest of these fires himself. Not for long! Another fire's out. How you doing, Harry? I'm bypassing every safety lock known to man. Living life on the edge. But I was thinking, there's always one thing that goes wrong with any big undertaking. This was our one. That's the last of them. It worked! <laughs> so you'll power it down, I'll grab the antidote, find Dr. Connors? Not so fast. There are 67 shutdown steps. If we take it out before, then we'll lose the antidote. Oof. Sounds like it's gonna be a while. You hungry? I could go get a pizza. Shut it down and get the antidote. I'll handle this. No Craven? I thought we had a thing going! You're not his only friend. Lee, tell me where he is. You got to break free. I'd like to keep my fight party small! I thought Craven was only going after super abilities. Why are they here? They must have tracked me after I stole the serum! Sorry, Harry! Why are you apologizing? I'm not worried, you've got the suit. Kick their asses! Shoot him! What step are you on now, Harry? Diverting the beam into the auxiliary tunnel. What's new with you? Well, I just got an extension on my student loans. Real excited about that! Coming down! small. I thought Craven was only going after super villains. 
Why are they here? They must have tracked me after I stole the serum! Sorry, Harry! Why are you apologizing? I'm not worried. You've got the suit. Get their asses. What step are you on now, Harry? Diverting the beam into the auxiliary tunnel. What's new with you? Well, I just got an extension on my student loans. Real excited about that. We're making good progress. Only 30 steps left until the antidote's ready. Great! Because I don't think these guys are gonna stop coming! You got this, buddy. Almost powered down. I'll finish it and grab the antidote. You need to get out. I of can't here. leave. I'm the only one. Watch who out! in these woods. Okay, before we get down to business, there's something I have to tell you. I'm fresh out of honey. Come on, I thought it was funny. You know, all this damage wouldn't take long to fix. Maybe we'd even keep some of it as a patch of honor. Oh, crap. Those arrows must have ruptured the accelerator's shielding. The beam's scraping the tunnel. Can you still shut it down? What about the antidote? It's still being made, but time to start crossing fingers.
that! You need to get out! No! There's just a few steps left. We can still finish the antidote. I know we can. Hunters! You all should have ran when you had the chance! Do you like smashing things? Could I smash your face? Nobody fire! You're gonna regret ever coming here! Hunters yet. Shoot him! Fight's down here, not out there. Foundation. I don't care about that right now. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Get in there and see what you can save. I want a detailed report of the damage. Your dad's right. The foundation doesn't matter. What? This was our dream. And it still is. But right now, we have to focus on finding Dr. Connors and getting you healthy again. I got this. get up to her, though, for missing her exhibit. Okay, dude. Hope the lead pans out. That's good. <laughs> Protesting isn't just the constitutional right to you. It's your civic duty. Especially when a multinational corporation is behind a bioweapon unintentionally getting released into the city.
friends of the Danacast, I woke up today with one question on my mind. What the hell happened at the Emily May Foundation last night? One minute we're talking philanthropy and using the means of production for good, and the next we're looking at a war zone. And yeah, listen, clearly those hunters were involved. Clearly they're the baddies here. But y'all saw the same footage of Spider-Man I did, yeah? The way that new black suit moves, how vicious it is. <sighs> Call me a worry ward if you want, but something ain't right. Times like these, take care of the little things. 64 ounces of water every day. See you soon, folks. Sorry, guys. Well, beach day is canceled. This is for your own good. <gasps> Sand crystals, all mine now. I lose the creeps at the school and come home. Walk through the front door. But you're not there. They are. What have they done to you, Kimia? Craven's real evil for having his people drag Marco's kid into this. Gotta find more crystals to figure out what went down. Marco's memory is returning and he's agitated. The doctors are piecing together what happened. It, it sounds like it's not all his fault. I'll let you know if I hear more. Coordinates are showing a stash near the top of the Braxton building. Lucky I found this first. Just send me after your crap. We'll keep the answer. In this skyscraper. Ever heard of the Braxton Heights? Uh, no. Exactly. It was my debut score as the problem. First time working with a crew, too. We went in to steal prototypes from Braxton's secret tech division. But this kid double-crossed us. Who? Never got her name. She was good. Pro. A thief in the truest sense of the word. It wasn't mad, though. It was a valuable lesson. Starting to get why you were dad's toughest case. <laughs> Good looking out on the stash, kid.
Wonder who got the best of Uncle Aaron. I mean, if I was rich, I'd take advantage of that backdrop too. I'd also be worried about constantly launching balls off a roof, but I guess they can afford it. Huh? 